Hi everyone, welcome to Medicine Not YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to see about drug tolerance. This is an important topic in pharmacology aspect. More dose is needed to produce a normal action. When the body produces a tolerance effect against a minimum dose, we require more dose to produce the particular action. Example, 2.5 mg of diazepam produce 8 hours of sleep. Normally, normally 2.5 mg diazepam produces 8 hours of sleep. After several months, this dose produces less duration of action, less duration of sleep because of the drug tolerance. Now, after few months, this drug produces lesser action so 5 mg of the diazepam is required for 8 hours of the sleep so here the patient develops tolerance to the effect of diazepam first 2.5 mg produces 8 hours of sleep now 5 mg produces 8, of, 8 hours of sleep so this tolerance produced by our body which is known as drug tolerance this is on two types the drug tolerance of is of two types one is natural tolerance one is and another one is acquired tolerance the natural tolerance are inherited by birth these are inherited by birth birth itself it is not be it is not acquired the uh, example the black race people normally atropine drug produces Midriasis in, in small doses in all people. In all peoples, this atropine produces midriasis. Midriasis means dilatation of the pupil. In small doses itself, this atropine produces midriasis in all people. But in these black race people, the black race people, the people tolerance of this drug. So instead of they provide other drug. These drug, this atropine, produce, atropine does not produce midriasis in black race people. So, the, the other drugs are used for the black race people. These people tolerant, the black race people tolerate this drug. So, instead of it, they produce another drug. This is natural tolerance because it is not inherited, this is not acquired, acquired by doing something, some works but it is inherited into a body at the birth itself. So it is known as natural tolerance. Now acquired tolerance. We have developed the tolerance by taking drugs repeatedly. When we take a particular drug repeatedly, a body develop a tolerance against the drug. So there is required of more mg, more milligram of the tablet. Example diazepam. I have already said that 2.5 mg of diazepam produces 8 hours of sleep normally. But after few days after using the drug for several months, 5 mg of diazepam only produces 8 hours of sleep because the body produces a tolerance against the diazepam. Like that example is drinks and alcohol. These are the examples of acquired tolerance. Earlier small doses is required. After there is a requirement of high doses. This is known as acquired tolerance. Now cross tolerance. Cross tolerance means opioid analgesics. They have same structure and action. If the drug has same structure and action, if the if the drug which which is if example if the having a tolerance of if some people having a tolerance to the morphine, they are also having a tolerance to the pethidine. Because morphine and pethidine has the same action as well as the same structure. So the, the tolerance produced by the morphine, if people tolerating the morphine, they also have been tolerating the pethidine because of the structure as well as action. And this is known as cross tolerance. Thank you. If you like this video, please do like, share and subscribe my YouTube channel. And that's all about the drug tolerance. If you have any doubt on it, please do comment it. Or else if you have any topic to suggest, please do suggest in the comment box. Thank you.